What's up, hope you guys are all right. I wanted to leave you guys with some thoughts. Hope your day is well. Happy today is... What is today? Monday? Huh. Anyway, um, some thoughts, ideas came to mind as I was uh, reading something my coach posted. And so what I want to talk to you guys about is just, uh, let's say I'll give you three, three key ideas or three key things that cause us to fail on goals. Um, one being your goal is too small. The goal is too small. Um, I read the uh, thing was the 10x rule. Some of you guys may know that book, but it talks about having goals that are how can I say this? Seemingly impossible. Uh, goals that are outrageous that uh, people can't fathom. Uh, number two. I think these two can go hand in hand. But number two will be there's nothing behind the goal. So, uh, a why. What is the reason behind you want to accomplish that goal? That's uh, the second thing that I will say um, affects our goal setting. Is number one. The goal is too small. Number two, there's nothing behind the goal in which pushes you. And number three is you have a goal with no actionable plan to accomplish it. So you have no a uh, blueprint mapped out on how you can accomplish that goal. You just know you want to accomplish it. You know, it's like wanting to build a house, but you don't know what you need. You don't take the steps necessary to find, uh, say, a carpenter or uh, price ranges on renovations, all that stuff. So, number one, the goal has to be seemingly impossible to the common ear because it's outrageous. It's something that is so far above your head that even if you come short just a little bit, that will be a, what word am I looking for? Magnificent support. That a magnificent accomplishment. Even if you come short of something great, it's better than not doing anything at all. But accomplishing something minimal, average. Don't get me wrong. We have our average steps. It takes a brick to build a. You know what I mean. But at the same time. Discerning in which way you should apply what knowledge or what skills. Um, so, three tips to help you set better goals. Huge goals. Goals you couldn't fathom, really, what it would be like. However, still knowing or feeling like you are already that person. You already have that amount of gratitude. You already have that perspective. Um, number two is having something behind the actual goal. What is the reason behind you actually wanting to accomplish it? And number three, having an actual step-by-step -step plan on how you're going to accomplish it. If I want to cross a certain threshold in my business. I have to have a specific plan in which I'm going to execute in order to accomplish it. Okay? So I hope those three tips helped somebody, helped you, helped your friends. And until...
the afternoon. I hope you guys enjoy your lunch time. I wish we had. And uh, I'm going to figure out what day it is. Be safe.